Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Minecraft Let's Play Episode 4. We are back, and... Okay, so quite a few things has happened. I uh, got out into the water, into the oceans, over yonder that way. And I uh, actually did some enchanting, and I got somehow got lucky and got only Death Strider 3 on this guy. So, which was a little unusual. No protection, so I'll have to uh, manually add that later. But that's okay, because I have Death Strider 3 now, I could actually you know, finally swim around waters without having to really worry about getting going like, Oh, it's going to take too, too long. So I don't have to worry about that kind of stuff anymore. And ooh, what's this little icon over here? Yes, I finally managed to set up my conduit. As you can see, this little thing is like a. It's well, it is the heart. It's the heart of the ocean. And I actually managed to get enough prismarine pieces to actually set up two pieces. And I checked on the wiki and it says that if I set it up this way, I could have this effect up to 96 blocks away, which means I no longer drown underground, like right here. Before, I would have drowned in this kind of place. If I try to mine stuff here, as you can see, I get a little bit of haste. Hey, where did iron just go? Where'd you go? Oh, hi. You floated up once. All right. Alrighty, you could float your boat. You float that boat. There you go. Thanks for the iron. Thank you for the iron. Wow, that's a lot of there's a lot of ravines in this area. Wow. I guess I just happened to choose in a spot that wasn't very well situated. Maybe. Ooh. Whoa! Look at this. Whoa. That is so different. Wow. Okay, so interesting note to self. If you go into a cave right after you take off the hard reaction effect, then you get this weird effect. Alright. So, in the between the episodes, what I did was that, and I, as you can see, I've cleared out a lot of the seagrass that was growing here in the populations. And I've actually went around in about, you know, five, six different times, and I've actually been cooking them. Oh, oh, did it run a few? Ah, that's fine. <laughs> yeah. So that's empty, that's empty, that's empty. Y'all cooked? Good. You're raw. Okay. You are still raw. Okay. Give me those, give me those, give me those. Fine, I said. Do, 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 do. 64 and 21. Alright, again, in that case. Oops, I need to do it this way, All right? So I'm gonna go and stick that in there. We're gonna stick. We're not gonna stick a whole block of coal there. That's a waste. Let's see, eight times four. That's thir no, eight times three, twenty-four. That's more than enough items for there. And you just take a piece of coal. And there you go. As you can see, I've been still gathering a lot of stuff. I got a lot of iron. I've been getting a lot, a lot of iron. And Dried kelp blocks. Wow, look at this. I'm, I'm getting a ton of dried kelp. You know, it means I could actually probably make a house out of dried kelp blocks. But why would I do that? Why? <laughs> That's silly. Oh, yes, and I've done a vicinity of the map around this area right here, and I have been breeding my turtles like crazy. I'll show you what happened with my turtles. So, you know how I had like four, three turtles hatched here? Well, two of them went back. And I, there's like one, two, three of them here now. So I've been breeding these two. Look at this. I now have one, two. I now have about a dozen eggs sitting here, just kind of like waiting to be hatched. Look at this. So I officially have a turtle egg farm. So, mm. but I just need to be careful when they're uh, when. What do you call it? What's the word? Uh, I have to keep an eye on them so in case I get shoots. And as you can see, my chicken farm is well underway also as well. Which, speaking of which, I uh, might have to switch. Stop pooping eggs, guys. Stop. Stop. I may make the automatic KFC machine again in the future. Maybe, maybe, maybe. But if you think that's, you know, 
But, you know, some people think it's too cruel to make that kind of machine. But, hey, I don't care. It's, it's for the common good. Alright, upstairs will be the furnace area. Mm. I don't know, guys. Now, with the tower, uh, right after I finished this, it kind of occurred to me, you know, if I uh, bust this open right here, in theory, right? Just this section right here. I just bust it open here. And put a little platform. I could make another airship right here. <laughs> Ah, uh, dear, the things I make to make myself miserable, right? This is why I can't have nice things, you know? Because <laughs> I end up making stuff that's just good. I don't know. Should I make another airship? I don't know. You guys need to tell me, you know? I should, I should, yes, make an airship again. And, you know, watch me fall to my death and you guys can mock at me. Or, no, you're always building those stupid airships. It's, it's silly. I'm getting tired of it. Just So, let me know. You guys you guys need to let me know if, if I should do that. And I moved all my noisy-ass wolves outside. I just got tired of them just always getting in my way when I'm trying to do stuff around here. So That's what's been going around my base. So, I thought I'd give you a little quick update. I am still kind of sore from yesterday. I've been helping my friend out and so shout outs to that friend if you know who you are then you know what I mean you know what I mean <laughs> but yeah thanks for watching guys that's it's just gonna be a short episode today I don't feel like doing long recordings but thanks for watching guys I will catch you in the next episode peace out